Hey guys, welcome back to Cyberpiece TV. This is Weekly Wraps. Let's begin with some international updates. Largest dark web sting operation recovers millions of euros and arrests 150 people. As per Europol, several high-value targets around the world were arrested after a successful sting operation, Dark Hunter, was completed. The operation aimed to investigate the marketplaces hosted on the dark web which were involved in the sale of illegal goods. A WordPress plugin leaves a million websites vulnerable to exploitation. Opt-in Monster, an email marketing plugin for WordPress used by over a million websites, was found to have vulnerabilities that allowed malicious actors to collect sensitive data from the websites and add malicious code to the websites using this plugin. Suspected member of the TrickBot gang extradited to United States, a Russian national, Vladimir Dunaev, who is suspected of being a member of TrickBot gang, the gang behind the computer banking Trojan that infected millions of computers of several organizations and institutions around the world and charged with conspiracy to commit computer fraud, was extradited to United States from South Korea. Now, moving on to national updates. Over 16 lakh people from West Bengal were sensitized on cybercrime in October, according to the government. The government of West Bengal has recently stated that over 16 lakh people in the state were sensitized about cyber crimes and how to prevent them in lieu of the exponential rise of cyber crimes in the state. Increased law enforcement cooperation announced between India and United States. Observing the ever-increasing threats and number of cases of cybercrime, the Justice Department has released a statement that there is a need of faster information, evidence sharing and greater cooperation with India in order to deal with technology-based crimes and enhance consumer protection. Mumbai Police warns people of Diwali lucky draw frauds. The Cybercrime Department of Mumbai Police has warned people about the traps laid down by fraudsters in the name of Diwali Lucky Draws and having titles of popular e-commerce platforms and also offering prizes of several lakhs of rupees. So that is it from this week's Weekly Wraps. Please do let us know if there is any news that you would like us to share and spread information about. Please do give a thumbs up and comment down your thoughts below. Thank you for watching.